welcome back to Candy Tube. Today, I have done another Lego project mock. As you can see over here, there's one standard in front of you, but this time, my Lego proje projects are a bit different because I have made more than one Lego project, which I'll be showing them all in this video. So let's start off with the first book. But before we get started, please make sure to subscribe and we'll be the happiest kids in the world. So if you did not know, I have made a reindeer. This was actually a human, but I, then after human, I changed it into a dog. After a dog, I changed it to a reindeer, and this is literally perfect. So the legs look like a dog feet, like how they have four feet in the front while they're sitting. At the back, I made his face yellow, because that's the only thing I could make. And if we go inside over here, this is actually a candy dispenser. You get to um, put candy in here. To see a better look, you have to take off this piece. And inside, you can store candy. I really like it. So I did not use any eyes in this. I have used my own Lego bricks to put it at the front. This is the nose. This is the mouth. That's one black people, one white. No, those are together, actually. And then over here, we have its antlers, which is very cool. I didn't really make it as accurate as possible, but still, it looks really good. And he's wearing a purple sweatshirt. Next up, we have furniture. We have one big bed, one small tiny bed for minifigures, and one small sofa. Shout out to my sis, because she actually made this sofa. So over here, let's start off with the big bed. Big B bed. So this bed is like, I don't know, I think this is two and a half inch long. I have no idea. But I made it as exactly like how normal bed is. We have the nice bed. Uh, uh, is that the bed sheet? Yes, the pillow. We have those bunk bed uh, areas and without those you will probably have on the floor and you don't want to be on the floor. Moving on to my tiny bed. So in the camera it's probably going to be very big but for me it's very small because this is for like a minifigure and this is just for like people if we're having like that Sesame Street house, I added this sofa, this, this sofa inside of it and this bed. Okay, moving on to the sofa. I really like the design, what my sis done. It's really good. It actually recreates a really cool sofa model, like how other Lego ideas are. Okay, so next is a turtle. This is a tiny turtle. I made it because I wasn't, I just, I had no idea what to make, so I just added um, these bricks inside as you can see there's a thing right over there it's um it has circles at the back and i connected it through it there and i was just messing about with this model and i came up with this such a good model and also guys there's a thing where you can open this up and he stores lettuce inside it's pretty gross but i actually made it as cool as i could so he just stores it inside of his tummy i think that's how it is and then he walks off hey there Moving on to the next model, and I possibly can't make another bigger turtle like this, right? Okay, so next I made my mum's cooker. <laughs> Lol. So basically, this is um, a cooker where I also made pots and pans, but there's only one because the other one broke. We have some settings where you can switch it the oven. At the back, it's plain white and my sis told me to make like an oven door but I forgot to make it so that's kind of strange what I did the pots and pans have a little hole in there so you can cook some chicken we're having some chicken for dinner I'm joking <laughs> and then you can like put it on each setting this one uh this one sets this up pretty well so it doesn't come off so easily these actually come off very easily and also at the back, I made a little hole for it. I didn't add another piece so that it can actually click in. So you can like pretend you're whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. All right, so next is my own pocket world, which actually comes with two chickens I made. My sis told me this also, so shout out to her also. It's uh, two little chickens. One is named Buck and the other one's named Buck. And together you, they unite their names called Buck Buck. So basically they have two houses and uh, the local area is called Buck Street. It's basically where all chickens live. I don't know if they're farmers or not, but 
But so uh, inside of each house we have oh we have different small houses. This was not supposed to be for them, it's supposed to be for someone else. But I just thought is for us. And then I just thought he can actually fit through the door. <laughs> yes, he can fit through the door. And then over here we have Buck's house. Pretty complicated, but so uh, oh so this door can open and hey you're not supposed to be in my house yes so that's um buck's house and this is buck's house and then if someone is coming and they don't like it like if it's a villain it's there's a thing you can do so you take off this doorknob i don't know how to take it off all right there you go and you put this big wall why well, i call it the big b wall and then it, the door does not open unless this wall barrier breaks off. And there you go, Buck's house is destroyed. So if you don't know this popular game, it's called Among Us. It's very popular on YouTube. Be sure to comment down below if you play it. I've seen a lot of gamers play this game. And I just thought I could recreate the Among Us characters in Lego. So here they are right now. This is one Among Us. This is two Among Us characters. What? We have a third Among Us character. OMG, a fourth one. Don't forget the third, f fifth one. What's going on, guys? We have our sixth Among Us character. Another one? There goes our eighth one. Another one? We have another one right over here. And another one. And another one. And another one. And hey, that's a ghost Among Us. And the last rare Among Us character, the Rainbow Among Us. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed all of my Among Us characters here, all of them in a row. I know I made a lot, that's so cool. Like this purple, this orange, this blue, this brown. Here are the Among Us characters. So guys, remember I told you at the beginning of the, of the video, I think, that I can't make a bigger turtle than this. Well, you were wrong. Da! Here is the ginormous, the ginormous turtle. Da! So here's everything I done. This is like, this was supposed to be another messing about model. I was just adding bricks over everything and I came across this turtle it looks so cool i made his shell this type of thing and the thing this turtle can do this turtle is not just a turtle it's a ship Ta -da! so basically minifigures can climb in here and they can go on a ship drive let's bring near all aboard the turtle spaceship wow oh my gosh my head is too big and here are all my Lego projects. So please subscribe and like and comment if you want me to do more Lego mocks like these ones. So I had really fun making all of these. Some I were messing about ones and some were real ones like these Among Us characters. I really enjoyed all of these. And all thanks to all of my subscribers, I was able to make a whole bunch of Lego models to show you in this video. Thank you so much guys for subscribing and liking all our videos, we really appreciate it. And thank you for everything that all you done. So thank you so much for watching this video, please subscribe and like and comment if you want me to do more Lego mocks. Tell me in the comments what else Lego models you want me to make so I can make a custom mock and then show it to you. It could be a real Lego set, a fake one, a rip off set or something else that I can make. And I'll see you in my next videos. Bye!